Hello and welcome to Docplex's Health Minute. Researchers from California have discovered a new SARS-CoV-2 lineage called B1X with multiple mutations that are also found in other variants of concern, but is not a recombinant itself. They further observed that eight genomes corresponding to this lineage were initially rejected by genome databases such as GSET and GenBank, leading to an underestimation of their frequency. US FDA has granted emergency use authorization for a novel antibody test for dried blood spot sample collection at home. This test will play an important role in helping healthcare professionals identify individuals who have developed an adaptive immune response from a recent or prior COVID-19 infection. The current mainstay for diagnosis and treatment of depression and bipolar disorders is largely trial and error. A breakthrough study by Indiana University School of Medicine offers a new blood test that aims at a precision medicine approach to treatment. The blood test is composed of RNA biomarkers that can identify the severity and risk for depression and bipolar disorder. The test also informs tailored medication choices for patients. According to a study published in the Journal of American Medical Association, 1 in 10 people have at least one moderate to severe symptom after 8 months of being infected by SARS-CoV-2, impacting their quality of life. The predominant long-term symptoms were loss of smell and taste, fatigue and respiratory problems. What can be done to improve the quality of life of COVID-19 patients? Let us know your opinion by commenting below. Health Minute, the most liked segment of Docplexes, brings you the latest happenings in the medical field. Stay tuned for more insights. Happy Docplexing!